<laughs> All right, guys, we're doing scorpions only, but we have the extra condition that you can't use uh, peanuts on any of them, and all of your scorpions have to have different equipment. So whenever you get a scorpion, you can't run it on your team if it has peanuts, you have to give it something else, and you can't have two scorpions with the same equipment, so you can't have two melons on two of them. It's, uh, it's gonna be interesting. So <laughs> Good luck. I guess I will be trying to go for this, like, mouse combination. It might not make too much sense, though, because maybe I want to, like, I don't know, freeze a pill in case I find a turtle later or something. Hmm. Or just some equipment in general. Yeah, this doesn't really make any sense. <laughs> I'm gonna leave that. I want the rolly guy. Where is... my boy? There he is. Alright. Let's be the wishy-washy rockets. If the test server goes down while you're in a match, it looks identical to lag. But when you refreshed, it was down. Oh. Lag is in the time and effort stops. No, I don't know. When, when you say lag, is that like when you, I don't know, buy something? It's like everything's kind of loading. And <laughs> main, be nice. I already had... Oh. We're doing this now. I want to find these guys, guinea pigs. Hey, we found one. <laughs> uh, freeze and roll once. But, yeah. All right. Decided to combine them this time. Not really any good reason for it. I just thought I'd go for it. But yeah, I'm hoping these lobbies go a little bit better than last week. <laughs> What's this streamer luck? What do you mean? This is barely luck. Like, this is nice. It was like a 1 in, you know, 10 or whatever it is. But this doesn't matter. If I don't get the combos of these, which I'm not very likely to, then, you know, <laughs> it doesn't matter at all. Got the exact same combo and you got to shrimp. Shame. It really doesn't matter, though, because, like, the play from here is going to be just spend the next, like, five turns rolling for, you know, three of these. Even when you don't find a guinea pig in 20 rolls. They're not out yet. Now they're out. But yeah, I'm rolling for more of these. We just need, like, maximum guinea piggage. Or oh, slots. I'd take a slot. No cheaters so far. That is excellent news. Last week's lobbies were great. Maybe for you. I feel like I died really early in most of them. I can't remember. I know the crocodile one was terrible. For me. <laughs> uh, I actually can't remember what else we did. Oh, an aspect. Thank you. You're talking about turns three to four. We're not there yet, though. You made it sound like you would like spend the first two turns rolling for guinea pigs that didn't exist. Yeah, we continue though. Like, ah, ah, don't look. Hold on. I have plenty of time to find another one. <laughs> Are you gonna try and do a bugged pack four when the update drops, like you did with the piano pack? No. I doubt they're gonna make that happen again. And I, yeah. <laughs> I doubt it would happen, and it's not like I hacked into the game or something. It was just a bug. You rolled past two times. Well, that's twice as many rolls as I did. <laughs> you guilt trip me into playing bad? I'm not guilt tripping anyone. I am. I encourage you to try and smash me in this game. <laughs> Within the rules. All right. Hey. Okay. Uh, so I do still need to wait, because I need to wait until, yeah, two more turns before we can maybe get scorpions from combos. So, I'm not sure. Maybe I should have frozen that, the guy, the Mamama set. If he shows up again, I'll, I'll freeze him. I thought he went through some specific steps of the bug, though. Not really, it was just play on an older version of the game. Which, like, if you're on PC... I don't know, because basically everyone has, like, automatic updates on PC, or it like, won't let you play until you update, but there are ways to get older versions of the game. But on mobile, you know, it's a lot easier to just launch the app and it hasn't already done things. I had something in my head just then, and I can't remember what it was. I felt like I needed to do something. You'll simply not update your game. I doubt they're going to make the same mistake again. Just, uh... Throwing that out there. 
Yeah, I have no idea what I was, I was thinking. What exactly are the rules? Oh, that was it. Yeah, I was going to change the um, my title to update it. Basically, we're doing scorpions only, but every scorpion has to have different equipment, and none of them are allowed peanuts. So if you get a scorpion, you need to have equipment ready as well, which is another thing. I should have, like, frozen something, just in case. Actually, no, I wouldn't be able to buy it on the same turn anyway, so I'd have to wait. So I would have some free rolls to look for something else anyway. But yeah, basically, only scorpions on your squad or sloths. Uh, everything has to have different equipment. Nothing can have peanuts. Those are the rules. You got three guineas in one turn. We you, like, looking for them the whole time? Anyway, we're here. Show me. Come on, we have many attempts. You are not a scorpion. Also, not a scorpion. Oh. <laughs> Shame. Hmm. Maybe freezing marmoset. I almost want to freeze that as well, but... <laughs> Maybe I should have frozen the other guinea. If I had found another one at the start of the next turn, then would have been in a similar situation. But sadly, no early scorpions. Got a scorpion, but didn't buy it because you have four gold. Yeah. We said different equipment on each one, right? Yes. Different equipment on each one, no peanuts. Oh my god, you can't buy food? Yeah, but <laughs> I said this. You'd have to wait to turn anyway. You got one and you forgot to freeze it? Oh god. That's not good. Okay. Uh, probably buying this because I need some extra rolls next turn. I'm buying this for the meme. <laughs> oh, wait. Another combination. And then I can like sell them after and buy sell the other mama set. Oh, it's a dream. No, I can't. Wait. I won't be able to buy or sell the mama set, but I can get another combination this turn. So this, <laughs> let's try it anyway. Not a scorpion. Okay, shame. Uh, I'm just going to end my turn here. I'm, there's no point rolling at the moment. So, I'm going to save my free roll for next turn. You combined three times, you got three turkeys. I'm almost jealous. Yeah, no one has one yet. There was the accidental guinea. Okay. Just have to hope I can find some of these. And, like, keep something frozen, too. <laughs> Like pepper, is that it? I think chili would be better, but I'm gonna keep this frozen just in case I don't find something. Uh, yeah, no, we need to, we need to hard roll. God, I wish I could keep this frozen, but until I find my first scorpion, then I can't, I can't do any of this. Am I just gonna freeze the lemon over it? Cause that'll get a lot better than pepper pretty quickly. I feel, cause I usually like go pretty hard on like turbo scaling one thing. That's only if I do find my scorpion. There we go. We have found one. Has some stats as well. You know what? I don't know. It's like a four gold four four. That's not worth it. <laughs> Never mind. That's not worth it. I'll leave that. But I do have my scorpion ready. No peanuts allowed? Yes, no peanuts. It's in the title. Okay, well, let's get this guy going then. Get big. Big and safe. I could buy pairs. I'd much rather get better value scaling though. Although there isn't actually that much because there's not much food scaling in this pack. So you'd mostly have to do it from like cows, zebras, and like pilling mammoths. Maybe these when you <laughs> get further. Same with owls. There's like a handful of things, but maybe I do freeze that. And chili is also pretty good for like the next one I find. If I do find another one. You have a 1621 lemon scorp? How? And what is this? That's not a scorpion. Did I miss it? Or was it the one that's like... Nah, I'm losing it. How did you turn that into like a... You like tripled its stats. Or doubled them. I guess you must have found like a couple of zebras or something. You can get a lot of stuff off that. Oh, <laughs> yes. Sorry, man. 
is too strong. And I found another one. All right. I do have to do this now, otherwise he's at risk. Remember, guys, you can't have duplicate uh, equipment. Probably going to leave mouse. Almost tempted to freeze a turtle, but I'm probably just going to freeze, like, Melanor. Yeah, I think for my last three, it's going to be these three things. But I'm probably going to have a slot open so I can, like, buy-sell for a while. So, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do with this. What are people running? I'm seeing quite a lot of frontline. Uh, yeah, I should probably throw this to the front just to like try and pop something. I feel like it's not as good because like what I always forget is Chili isn't. It doesn't like. Oh, I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> it is like it does five damage. So even if my Scorpion's doing one damage, the Chili will always do five. For some reason, I had it in my head that uh, this would always just like. You know, it'd be capped at 5, but it would do your attack damage, your splash damage. Which is very much not how it works. <laughs> Alright. Let's make him larger. Nah, you can stay where you are. Hey, not bad. Another scorpion as well. There is also popcorn. Which might be better for right now. I'm gonna leave cat. I don't know where I'm gonna find more um, stuff for that. This is all pretty good. A grape scorpion. Insane stuff. You just came back and here's a chili lemon scorp. Yeah, of course I do. It's the new meta. Looking pretty good so far though. I just want to find some steaks. I feel like a steak on one of these would be pretty good. Very strong, like, front line. You just dropped your phone in the toilet. How are you typing this? Oh, I guess it's after it's been retrieved. <laughs> oh god, I have no clue. Uh, very sorry to hear that though. Yeah, you can stay at the back. I like where everything else is, I think. Your computer? What? So you like dropped your phone in the toilet and then ran to your computer to tell us? <laughs> I don't know, I never bring my my phone into the bathroom unless I'm like showering just for music. You cleaned it? That is good. But is it, is it ever going to be clean again? After it's been in there? To be fair, it's probably like a lot cleaner than most people's phones because I have a feeling most people like never clean their phones. I probably don't do it as much as I should, but yeah. <laughs> I have to imagine they get pretty nasty over time. Even if you can't see it. Debating whether it would be worth like buying that before I selling some of this stuff, but nah. Alright. I need what? Mammoths? I could always like pillar piranha. It's a decent valley if I find one. Uh yeah, sure. I'll freeze a snake. Steak in case I find another dude. Probably should have bought the pair. I forgot there's like no... <laughs> there's like no stat food in this pack. Unlikely to find more. This is huge though. Yeah, we're going to be getting a lot of stats next turn. Accidentally combined a steak scorp with your melon scorp. Oh no. It's been a little while since I did that last. Damn, <laughs> what is this mode? It's just a versus lobby. Oh no. Oh yes! Wait, did I... Did I summon a scorpion with my popcorn scorpion? So I actually did have like a <laughs> a regular peanut scorpion in the fight. It saved me. So very kind. <laughs> Alright, let's grab a load of these stats then. I'm going to need it. Uh, these two maybe? I'm not sure what like, would be best for those. I could freeze a tap here instead. Because I could always just like pill that to get another scorpion, but I don't know if I will, because I'd have to keep this frozen as well, and then... I don't know. Eh, uh, maybe. I'm gonna freeze this. It's not even like the best thing to pill. That's pretty good though. Oh, never mind, we found one anyway. <laughs> Alright, so I have another thing on my turn. That's cheating? It's not cheating! It's when you hit end turn, it's not my fault that my popcorn summoned another scorpion. 
And imagine doing a birds only challenge. I want to do that again in... Uh... We've done it in viewer lobbies a lot, but I've done it in like actual arena before as well. And I feel like it's going to be somewhat easier when the new pack comes out, because there's going to be a whole new load of birds. Eh, you know, I'll freeze all of this. These stats aren't too bad. No idea when I'm going to find a pill, so <laughs> we'll take it. Let's see, though. What's the best order? The front line isn't looking very scary. Except for that, but stake doesn't work very well against that. But then there are these other stake dudes. I don't know. Maybe I throw it like this? I'm afraid, because this thing, this thing will die to chili. And there are a lot of people running a front line chili. There aren't that many second line chilies. There's a couple. Okay. Someone has two peppers, angry face. Where are they? Tell me their name so I can ban them. No. <laughs> I'm kidding, but yes, that is not meant to be allowed. Lobby idea, only panda and popcorn. We actually have tried that before. We had like pandas only and it was like honey, popcorn and mushrooms. I think popcorn was the preferred thing. Yeah, this is like buy all this. Uh, I need you to be slightly above, like, five, so you can maybe survive a hit. Hey, this is pretty good. Okay, I'm kind of tempted to put him there now, because this thing probably... We're probably not going to get swiped twice. So I think I'll trust him here. Is it allowed to pill Walrus? No. I mean, is Walrus even in here? You'd have to, like, pill an Orca to get a Walrus. So, like... And then it just looked like a normal scorpion, so yeah, I don't trust that at all. Decided popcorn, eagle, orca, eagle. Oh my god. And royalty, hello, good morning. Yeah. Except, still kind of weird trades, but made it through. Okay, so, definitely pulling this. We start the big stats for everyone. Uh, buy one of these for someone, too? I feel like that one makes the most sense, but I don't know if I want to go all in on one thing. I'm gonna throw one there and just roll, keep that frozen. Uh, genuinely don't think it's worth keeping this yet. Like, most of the stat gain has to be from an empty slot, so... On the last turn, sure, like, throw in a fifth thing, but... I don't think it's worth freezing this, I think I just keep going. Yeah, there's, it's like, there's barely any stat food. It's basically all from pears and uh, salad balls. So if I find a couple of pears, then the cat's probably worth it. It's definitely worth it for a couple of pears. It might be worth it for one as well, though. It's like similar value to an owl. Just depends how long I keep it frozen. There's definitely like an opportunity cost in keeping stuff frozen for like half the game for no reason. Still safe, but <laughs> I need I need my state guy to actually be killing things. I'm not buying an apple. I just refuse. Uh pill is almost tempting. Not to pill anything that's already here, but like keeping it frozen, because there are a lot of things that are good to pill. But unless I find one of those things, then what's the point? Yeah. <laughs> there he is. There's the thing that I wanted to fill. Okay. Well, I can't use two cats. I could, like, you know, buy cat, buy all my food, sell cat, then keep the other cat frozen for, like, more food in the future. That's a maybe. Yeah, I think I'll freeze it. Alright, so again, teams, how are they looking? There's a lot of people trying to avoid, like, chili. <laughs> cat cow. I don't think I've seen any cows for a while. I remember I found one like with, with my first scorpion, and I think that might have been it. Might have found a second one. See you later, Sybil. Hope you had fun. Oh, Well, <laughs> probably wouldn't have made it past that anyway. Might be fun to do the same thing, but peanut allowed if it's your fifth food. Yeah, makes sense to me. Oh, well now I don't know what to do. Okay, I'm going to buy, sell this, buy cats, buy pear, uh, put it on you, sell cats, buy salad, and end my turn. I didn't want to just leave the snail frozen, and I didn't trust, like, 
Yeah, if I didn't buy it this turn, I don't know if I'd be able to use it next turn, so. Yeah. I thought it was worth going for the 4 4 now. It's got that sloth in free play. Hey. Wait, no, you're in this lobby, right? You're allowed to use sloths if you find them, by the way. But... Oh no, you died and now you're in free play. Hey! <laughs> Alright, hope it goes well then. And your popcorn spawned a scorpion. Good. It's like the best thing. You only survived one round because popcorn scorp spawning a scorp. I feel like that is one of the best things to get. Like, I need. Yeah, like to beat that, I need a scorpion from my popcorn. Or maybe orca whale stuff. Orca eagle, just over and over again. It'd have to go for a long time, though. Alright, let's push these. Please, I need, I need pills. These are also not bad. It might not be enough to keep me alive, but they're not bad. Uh, yes, definitely freezing. Oh, please, let me live. <laughs> I don't even know what I do next turn. Like, do I go for the mammoth first? It's more stats, but then I like have too much stuff frozen. Because I probably want to use the cow and the salad on the same turn as the cat. Yeah, I'm just going to leave it. <laughs> I trust. I trust this can do something. I almost want to move that one to the back, but I feel like it'll just get eaten up by one of the regular lemon ones. Although there isn't a... Well, <laughs> there's no lemon, but it was like way too big. Alright, GG's. Made it to like top six. Not too bad. I wish everyone who's still in the game good luck. Howdy, why is everything frozen? Because I wanted to buy everything. Except I died, so I didn't get to. But <laughs> yeah, if you freeze something in the shop, then it'll still be there at your start of the next turn. All right, but yeah, GG's. I just need to check. Did I have a prediction going? I didn't. Good. Okay, let's see, though. Do we want to do a non-shop? It'd be a similar non-duplicate thing, but obviously any equipment, it'd be the pets themselves that are non-duplicates. If not, then I can have a quick look through things. Hmm... I don't know, there are so many ideas, but a lot of these things I want to wait until the new like the new pets come out, because then I can like make the pack so much more interesting. Like dogs only, they added like three new ones. Maybe four if you include the golden retriever. But I don't think there's a way to get that with only dogs. Oh no, there actually is, yeah, with the cherry. Hmm. I'm thinking for the last two lobbies, it might be like Non-shot pets only, and then maybe a no-scaling pack. You lost. Oh. Sorry to hear. Sloth, sloth rounds are hard. Like, I have not had good luck on my sloth games. Alright, go to this then, so... Non-shot. Non-shot pets only. So, just for reference, this is anything that you can't buy from the shop. I know a lot of you guys probably already know this, but... For anyone that doesn't, it means stuff like uh, the bus that you get from pilling a deer, the chick you get from pilling a rooster, rams, uh, a bee, uh, zombie cricket, zombie fly, all of those things. Loyal chinchilla. You're back. Welcome back, Balson. You're just in time for the next lobby. GG Scorp Lobby. Wait, Cybran, did you win? I think you had 4 HP when I last saw. Yeah, who won that one? So what's the non-shop pets rule? I just said, anything that you can't buy from the shop, so... Things you get by pilling other things that can't be bought from the shop, so... Bee, bus, zombie cricket, zombie fly, all those things. Loyal Chinchilla is the first one you can get for the first couple of turns, so... Basically just look for that at the start and then... <laughs> You're good, and I'll explain it when the game starts. Guinea pigs are Wait, guinea pigs, friend? I'm not really sure what you mean by that. Guinea pig hasn't had a separate summon for a long time. Guinea pigs summon, like, themselves. You won in time for the shop. Oh, you did win. Nice. Congratulations. 
Alright, so I'll leave this like another 20 seconds or so, and then I think we'll be jumping in. They used to summon Guinea Piglet, but not anymore. Yeah, well, that's the thing. They never did it on the main game. Like, that was only a test server thing. And, like, you know, the <laughs> janky auto pets main game thing. So, for most people, they probably, like, never knew that if they didn't play on the test server. Yeah, I think, we, I think we're good to jump in, then. So, let's go. Alright, guys, <laughs> we're in, and we're doing non-shop pets only. No duplicates. So this means you can only use things that you can't buy directly from the shop. That's things like uh, the deer, the bus you get by peeling a deer, the thing you get by peeling a chick, uh, <laughs> a bee, zombie cricket, zombie fly, all these sorts of things. Loyal chinchilla is going to be the first thing that you can get uh, in the first couple of turns, but yeah, try not to have two of the same thing. Otherwise, everyone's just going to be running like a load of loyal chinchillas because it's usually pretty easy to just stack stats on whatever you get early instead of waiting for late game things. But uh, yeah. Good luck, everyone. Any equipment you want, you can buy, sell, whatever during your turns. You can have a sloth if you find it. But, good luck. Alright, I'm definitely going to be having one of these. I found a loyal chinchilla. Okay. Uh, pretty tempted to just buy this apple. Yeah, I think I will. It's better than, like, rolling three times unless I do find, like, multiple loyal chinchillas or otters and stuff. Probably saves me money. So yeah, let's be the wet eggplants. Two chinchillas at start, Pog. It's non-duplicates. No! <laughs> Guys, try and combine. Hold on, I'll put it in the title. But yeah, please combine everything together. Just have, like, one of each thing. So, like, if you find two chinchillas, then just... Just do this. Keep everything together. Yeah, I'm buying this apple. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna keep pumping this. So many cheaters. Maybe I didn't explain it well enough. I can't remember if I said non duplicates, but yeah. No duplicates. I already had caps on. Yeah, I, I think I didn't mention it or something. I'm sorry. But yeah, guys, please, only have one of each thing. So otherwise, everyone's just going to be running, like, you know, full teams of loyalty chillers the whole time. Does Guinea Piglet still appear in the achievements? It did the last time I checked. I don't know, I'll be checking after the next update, because I'm, I'm still waiting. There's... I don't know, I feel like it has to get removed at some point. Uh, is there any reason to get that level up? It's easy stats, at least. Eh, not really, but I'm gonna do it. <laughs> stats aren't bad. Blobfish. You know, I don't mind pilling that. If I can find a pill, it'd be great. Flamingo is also very tempting, but leave it for now. Alter again, decent stats. Really hoping to find a pill though, because then I can get like a B out of this too. Could be good. Not playing, but don't remember exact hearing exactly no duplicates. Yeah, I guess I didn't say it then, but that's usually the role we go with this lobby, because since they added loyal chinchilla, every time we do um, just regular non-shot pets only, we just end up with like... <laughs> the top, like, 10 people all just have teams full of Lord Chinchillas, because they're the easiest things to get early. You know, a lot easier than most of the other ones, you don't need, like, a pill, and they start bigger than a lot of other ones. Oh, dude. Alright, so let's do this. Uh, I don't know what to do here. Like, do I still want to be buying these? There might be better ways to scale next turn, like buying salad bowls, by selling owl. I'm going to leave the altar, I think. How are the teams looking then? I am seeing some zombie crickets. Very nice. Zombie cricket and a bee. <laughs> I don't know why I'm like buying so many of these. Like, there's no reason to get the level up site. Like, really? I would say no reason, but yeah. <laughs> I'm mostly just doing it to get the like one-on-one -on -one stats, which feels kind of sad. Oh, I can't tell if it's worth it. I'd much rather find, like, garlic or salad balls or owls. I'll even, like, freeze a blobfish or something. Oh, well. I said I would. <laughs> and, you know what? Let's buy sell that, just because it's going to be, like, the end of my turn, really. And we did find garlic. Excellent. Alright, you're going to need it. 
You're getting very big, and yet you might be able to, like, trade through pretty well. There are some big things here, though. Oh, see, like, double zombie cricket. You have to combine them. You know, sometimes I think it'd be kind of cool if they added, like, interactive stuff to the background. It's like in Hearthstone, there's always there's these, like, little things at the edges of the... Of the UI thing that you like tap on and just like jiggle around. I kind of want that. I don't know why. I think I just like I'm fidgety. Okay, unfreeze snail now probably. Uh, yeah, we're definitely not going for another one of those. Yeah, probably just leaf blobfish now. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get like good value after that again. And then we do find the pill. Whatever. Another salad bowl probably. Yeah, I'll freeze the sour ball. I think it makes sense to me. Honestly, having the clownfish isn't bad either if I do find another chinchilla. I haven't been, like... Honestly, I can't remember if I have seen any, but I haven't been looking out for them because at this stage, I don't think it's worth it. Like, two gold for 1-1. One, one. It's worth it in the early game, but, like, at this stage, there's definitely more efficient ways. Assuming you'd have to, like, roll a ton to find them. Guinea pigs don't count, right? They're not... You can buy them from the shop, so no. Grams from a sheep uh, have worked. Yes. Anything that you can't buy directly from the shop. And sloths, which you can, but, you know. Separate thing. Yeah, I'm not freezing any of this. Definitely doing this. Again, here's the thing, which I could maybe do. Because if I get a cow or a zebra, then that's really nice. That might be worth looking for, actually. Like, that's, that's not bad. And I can buy the pair afterwards, so it's decent. Scorpion. Okay. <laughs> well, that doesn't matter at all. So I'll just buy this and move on, I think. But yeah, like the full list of things are basically zombie cricket, loyal chinchilla, uh, bee, rams, bus, chick. Zombie fly. And that might be it. That might be it. I'm not sure. I, I never know if I'm missing something. Maybe I should be in investing in my <laughs> my big guy a little bit more. Hey, dear. Give me a pill. Next turn, give me a pill. Well, give me a pill for next turn. It's more what I mean. I want it ready. I also love the stats on these things, like 10 10, 20 20. Pretty satisfying to look at. Gotta go over CS Kino. See you later, Spinny. Two ads, 8 seconds and 14 seconds. Love it. I've actually noticed that the ads on Twitch have been really weird lately. Like sometimes I'll like get an ad and I'll change the. Because like sometimes I have streams open in the background, so I'll like set them down to like 360p instead of 1080. Because my internet's usually, like, suffering for no reason. Uh, but yeah, if I, like, join a stream, I get an ad, and then I change the resolution while I'm, like, they're at the ad's playing. Sometimes it'll just, like, cancel the ad. And I don't know if that's intentional, but I don't mind it. <laughs> no, I need another thing. Let me get this deer. I need the bus. I mean, I'm taking these things. I'd much rather buy this after I have the bus, but... Yeah. Uh, pepper on you, maybe. I might have to do that. I'd rather melon. Like, I'd much rather melon. But, yeah, I think I have to do this just to try and stay alive for now. Keep it frozen. Continue buying, like, good food, though. And spread them out as much as we can. You found the ad glitch in the ad matrix. Uh, it's hard to say. Like, there's always been... Oh, Twitch ads just change so often. That they've always seemed a little bit janky. So I imagine it's not going to be a thing for too long. Especially considering it's not consistent, and it's only been doing it for me for, like, three days. <laughs> yes! Main. I'm sorry for that. <laughs> That was that was a good fight for me. 
Yeah, I'm popping that one. Like, unless we get different equipment on there, then I'm not feeling it. I'm freezing this turkey as well. No sheep. I don't care for the rams. We have found a pill. Excellent. There's also like loads of platypuses. Like, I'm, it's, it's just a free 2 HP. Like, why would I not go for it? Ah, uh, massively frozen shop. Have you respectively dying game so I can play one lobby instead of missing it all? I'll probably do another one after this anyway. Yeah, I think I'll do one more after this. Like I said, I might do a no scaling pack. <laughs> Unfollow, unsub. Take your bin away from you. Oh, leave the bin. Where is where is my bin? Or maybe I don't have it. I don't know if I have Pepe hides like in Twitch. Oh no. All right, let's start with this. No, I'll have room anyway. I just don't know if I'll have enough gold. I think I do. Yeah, I'll have like one extra gold. Okay, so we can do this way to start. And I can sell all these. Do not accidentally sell something else. <laughs> I'm freezing this. Ah, that was a juicy turn. Look at this empty shop. <laughs> it's so nice. Okay. Maybe run it like that? I'm wondering what my other thing should be. I need at least one other thing on this team. And I don't know what I'm going to pick. No scaling, like no bison or hippo. Literally like no, there's no way to gain stats other than leveling things. And no, you can do just do that in the pack too. It'd be easier to just like show you guys, but yeah. It's basically just a pack that has no stat food and no pets that give other pets buffs. Can you rolling? Sounds a maybe, but I'd much rather find a pill or something, so I'll roll a bit more. And you know what? I think whenever I find this mammoth, I like buy the fly as well, and we go for a zombie fly. Because I never do zombie flies in these lobbies. Like <laughs> they always get left behind. Ah, uh, this, this stats. How much longer in the game? Not a long time, and everything's still pretty small. I think I do take these. I never scale, so it sounds like something I could win. I mean, you still need to get lucky. There's luck, but it's not like scaling luck. Uh, just keep pushing this, I guess. I don't know, do these two. I'm gonna freeze the other mammoth, but... <laughs> I don't know, who knows when I'm gonna find another pill. Yeah, I'm leaving that. Leave the pair. I just, I just want a pill or two pills. Two pills would be amazing. You died. Yeah, I see a lot of people are dying. In the final five now, and always delicious. Still max HP. Like, look at all these melons. Have I even seen melons yet? Or are they not in the pack? They're not in the pack. You have to pill turtles. <laughs> Although, I don't know if I've seen a turtle for a while either, so... Who knows, maybe I can still claim bad luck. Oh no, it's, it's the good team. Please, have mercy. Uh, I'm just gonna keep buying stats. It's probably not the play, but it's what I'm doing. Oh. Okay, so who is left in this? The front thing is really... Like, this thing is going to, like, destroy me unless I run my biggest thing at the front. But if I go against this team with this guy at the front, then I'm also screwed. I think. Maybe not, actually. Maybe that is my best play. Hmm. I don't know. This whole thing's a bit janky, but... Maybe maybe I'll get lucky and this will be it. One HP in a dream. I can't see this winning in its current form. If I got Melon on this guy and uh, got another thing on my team, then we could maybe do something with this. No. <laughs> Very dead, okay. Well, like top three or four, that's, that's not bad.
GG's and uh, Cybran, always delicious. Good luck. Hope the end of the game goes well. Alright. Anyway, let's get on the last one then, because I need to start fast. Need to save that. This is... I changed it a little bit, but I can just <laughs> fix that every time. Alright, let me get the no scaling pack then. Imports. Probably need to change it a little bit. I don't. Okay, that's great. So yeah, basically, this is just a pack that just has no way to get uh, extra stats on your units. At least not in, like, in the permanent sense. <laughs> you can still have... There are some other things, like, I think I do have a uh, Stego. I don't have Stego. There are ways to gain stats, like, in battle. Or small. They're not, they're not permanent, though. I mean, I could take them off, maybe, but... The idea is you're still, like, able to get stuff, but there's no there's no scaling. Horse and Moth aren't scaling. I don't think there's anything else I need to change. It's been a long time since I played this, though, so I'm worried something, something else has changed. Alright, there is Triceratops. Is there a way to ping that? There's no Hedgehog or Badger, so I don't think so. Apple? Why is Apple in here? Oh my god. Uh, till the end of battle. Okay, thank you for pointing that out. Yeah, this seems mostly fine though. It's like, yeah, and there's no way to get Orc either. I think we're good then. Let's, let's just... Let's try it. No skull. Just came back. What are the rules? Uh, it's, I mean, I guess no rules. It's just the... The pack is the rule. It's basically no scaling. So there's no way to get any extra stats. No scaling pack. Everything goes, boys? Yeah. It's a special pack, but it's basically no rules. So no stat foods either. Yeah, yeah, there shouldn't be any in the pack. For some reason, there was an apple in there. Which I have no idea. I, I must have, like, when I made it, I just, um, was not thinking. But yeah, there shouldn't be any stat food in the pack. Any permanent stat food. How <laughs> to scale stuff? You don't need to. You can still level things. Like there's chocolates and stuff, and you can always you can get you get stats by combining things, but that's it. So you can only get like up to plus five five by stacking six of the same thing. Yeah, yeah. It's it's base stats only except with levels. Sloth is the scaling. I almost wish Sloth did have like a special ability. Well, I get it to level 3, and then it has an ability. Thanks for the hydration, Brory. What the? I just drunk. Alright. Another, like, 20 seconds, I think. More water? Okay. Water equals good. It is, yeah. I think we were at 26 in like the last couple of lobbies, so we'll probably just like be starting this one. Everything else is good. What do you drink out of? Uh, a hydro flask. I got this like a couple of years ago, I think, and it's been it's been my my daily my daily water thing for like a long time now. But yeah, let's get into this then. All right. Guys, we're back. It's the final lobby of the day, and we're doing no scaling. Basically, there is no way to get permanent stats on your, on your units in this pack. But other than the fact that we're using this pack, there are no rules. You can go crazy, buy whatever you want. But basically, everything is going to be default stats uh, when you buy them slash in your shop. Uh, unless you stack things together, because that is the only way to get stuff. But that kind of caps out at plus 5-5 five, five by stacking six of the same thing together, so... Yeah, <laughs> just go crazy. What would be the tasty eyes? Let's do it. 
to a flask, rich boy. This was an investment. Like, I'm going to be drinking out of this thing until it's like, I don't know, dangerous too. Because like, I can't imagine these things break or... I don't know, I don't do anything with it, so... <laughs> it's not like it gets messy. It's like, wash it out every now and then and it's all good. Is there tamarind? There shouldn't be. No, there's not. Waiting for the Kino Hydro Pass sponsorship. I have not seen them sponsor anyone, so I don't know if that's the thing. But I'd probably do that. I much prefer the idea of getting sponsored by something that I like use every day. Yeah. Okay. Level 3 sloth should be the equivalent of the God Nuke instant win. I I actually kinda wanna see that. <laughs> as long as they like take it out of the pool. If you if you are the team that goes against the level three sloth and you just insta lose, that'd be the most like crushing thing. Like, just imagine getting a level three sloth and just selling everything else. Because you know it's going to win anyway. I just want more things to have like a level up ability. It's the same with the scorpion. Like it needs it needs something. I don't know. Auto goes to 50-50. Or, or if it gets to level 3, it gets to scale past 50-50. I like that. What if both have a level 3 slot? I don't know. Maybe it's just the, you know, whoever has the highest attack triggers first. I don't know. Blowfish, yes. I'm also stacking all these. I shall have big mama set. Freeze these, probably. Uh, I doubt I'm going to be going for that. I could maybe see Raccoon being good, but it's going to be very, like, low HP. If I can't scale this HP, then it's going to be kind of hard. So I'd have to scale it with, like, in-battle stuff like Camel. I don't know. What's going to be good in this pack? I don't know a meta yet. I can see Woodpecker Pineapple being pretty good. I don't think I take any of this. Oh my god, so many snipes. There isn't any way to scale. Oh no! Oh no, how did this happen? <laughs> That's the point! We're not meant to be able to scale. I don't know what I'm doing though. <laughs> like, I have no idea what's because like synergies are going to be so much more important. But I I don't know what sort of synergies are going to work with this. Like I feel like bats always good. Just having a bat and then you know leveling it can be amazing. Let's roll a bit. I like to find yes. Buy this. Freeze that. Unfreeze pill probably. And yeah, then we have two combinations. Hopefully find some like, good tier force. Oh, you were trying to find a way, staring at it for like two minutes. <laughs> yeah, I know there is um because there are a few things that could maybe be used if you could damage your own pets, because there's like, you know, camel and triceratops. But there there aren't ways to damage your own pets in this. Like, not permanently. No leech, no badger, hedgehog. So it should be safe. Links? That's not bad. I got lots of snipes if I can level that some more. Uh, Donkey I feel like is completely useless though, so I may leave that one behind. And now that I think about it, bad actually may be kind of bad, at least for the snipes, because there's no way to scale this, which means that is always going to be much larger. Let's see if I can find a woodpecker though, because that could be amazing. Bat. I don't know. I don't know if I'm keeping you. <laughs> I think I'm gonna roll it. I think the bat probably goes at some point. I don't know. Maybe I should be taking these dolphins though. Like those could be pretty good as well. If everything is like very low HP, then dolphins, like snipers, probably become a lot more useful than usual. Oh, stork could be amazing actually. Yeah, yeah, because storks do summon things that are, like, several times as big if you scale them up. I did just roll one, but... 
Wasn't sure if it, still wasn't sure if it was worth going for. Oh, come on. Give me something. I don't want these things. Okay, I, <laughs> final turn. I'd have to sell Marmoset just to buy it. I mean, I could sell Seals to buy it, but yeah. Probably not happening. I think I go for like Deer or something instead. I think a summon build may work pretty well with this. Yeah, we're not going for that either. Can't you Woodpecker the Triceratops? Woodpecker is in battle though, it's not like permanent. Is Dolphin not better than Blowfish? Probably. Depends. If everything's really small, then maybe this thing will get like several hits in. You pineapple the wrong pet. How does that happen? Oh god. See, like these snipes just destroyed me. Yeah, and then <laughs> absolutely, absolutely massive stalk at the back. Okay. Oh, Turtle Micro? Dude. There's like Turtle Micro Tiger <laughs> Octopus. But if other people are doing like start of battle snipes, then I don't know if I'd survive it. I can pill it though. I think I do take this for the pill thing anyway. But I'm gonna leave Micro. Eagle would be strong. It would be, yeah. Does that work the same way as Stork, where like everything it summons is like several times as big? I think it does. That could be, yeah, like I said, very good. Take this for now. Uh, stack this. I'm going to leave you. <laughs> Alright. Send it like this. Hopefully this will get me somewhere. I need to get rid of the mama set at some point, but it's, it's too big. Like, nothing can scale, so it's actually just very large. Oh, no. I am now on lethal. Hmm. Let's get rid of the bat. The bat isn't doing too much. So level this right away. Eagle! Save me. <laughs> Save me somehow. Uh, Freeze pill. I don't know, because I want to get like lemon on this next turn. And I want to find a mushroom for that eventually. But maybe I do... Like pill that onto there next turn. And you know what? Let's just keep pushing this. I don't mind. Walk's pretty good as well compared to some of the other stuff, but we can find tier fives instead. Yeah, for now, let's just run it like this. If you get out early, what do you do? What do you mean? Summon scum was not the answer. I can see it being the answer though. Like if it depends how it goes, but if you get like a load of storks and eagles, then you would defeat summon scum teams. Uh, sorry, sniper teams. I think. Yeah, I'm dead anyway. This is a scary hippo. Yeah, <laughs> I can see hippo being pretty good in this as well. Oh well, I guess I am dead. GGS. Good luck to everyone still in the game. What do you do while waiting for the others? Oh, EG set up the next one, but in this case, it is the hour, and it is time to swap things. Like, look, the docket's all messed up, because we're already a bit late. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to change that then. Yeah, I'm going to be swapping games. I'm going to be playing some Super Animal Royale for a bit.